In the movie The Super Mario Bros, when Luigi's phone rings, the sound of the Nintendo GameCube startup jingle can be heard as his ringtone. You'd be surprised. Additionally, the default caller icon on his phone bears a resemblance to the default Mii character that has been a fixture on Nintendo systems since the Wii. Hello, Super Mario Brothers! Eagle Eye viewers can spot a French restaurant called Charles du Canard in the background of some shots filmed in Brooklyn. What makes this restaurant significant is its name, which translates to Duck Hunt in English, a reference to another popular early Nintendo game often bundled with the original Super Mario Bros. game in 1985. The logo of the restaurant features the iconic duck from the Duck Hunt game released in 1984, which adds to the reference's cleverness. The attention to detail in incorporating such easter egg in the movie's background is impressive, and it shows how filmmakers are paying homage to Nintendo's early games and their place in pop culture. I got this! They're not even looking in the right place! In this scene, Mario and Toad encounter two Toad guards as they attempt to gain access to Princess Peach's castle. The guards deliver a line that is sure to bring back memories for fans of the original Super Mario Bros. video game released in 1985. They jokingly say, Oh wait, I did. Our princess though is in another castle. Oh yeah, that's right. You should try another castle maybe. She ain't in this one. Which is a clever reference to the game structure where Mario had to complete several worlds to rescue the princess. At the end of each world, with the exception of World 8, a toad will inform Mario that the princess was not there and he needed to keep searching. This iconic phrase has become a staple of the Super Mario Bros franchise and is instantly recognizable by fans worldwide. During the plumbing commercial, the background music playing is a catchy theme song from the popular children's show, The Super Mario Bros Super Show which aired in 1989 and featured Lau Albano and Danny Wells as Mario and Luigi. The Mario Brothers and Plummins again We're not like the others who get all the fame We're the Mario Brothers and Plummins again We're not like the others who get all the fame In the opening scene of the movie, a game cabinet situated in the pizzeria catches the viewer's attention with its title, Jumpman. It is interesting to know that this name is a nod to the original name of the beloved video game character Mario, who first made his debut in the popular video game Donkey Kong in 1981. Originally called Jumpman, Mario was depicted as a carpenter who had to rescue his girlfriend from a giant gorilla named Donkey Kong. However, as time progressed, the character's name underwent a transformation and he came to be known as Mario as a tribute to the landlord of Nintendo of America's warehouses. Mario Sigali. It is fascinating to see how a character's name can evolve over time and how a tribute to a real life person can become an iconic symbol in popular culture. Is this what you came for? Yeah,